What is up guys, it is Missy here from Galactic Music X Room. Welcome back to another one of my videos. In today's video we're going to be doing a review and demonstration on Mio Pup from Tiger Electronics. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So first of all, let's just start off with Mio's bone. Um, <clears throat> it's pretty basic. But I guess that's because Tiger Electronics were trying to aim for the most basic and realistic design possible for the bone when making this product. <clears throat> um, but yeah, this is a bone. It, it's very basic, but still very, very realistic. We have the two screws here. Um... But don't worry, there's no batteries in this. It's just just screws. I'm presuming to get the bone itself pieced together. Um, and then you have the realistic effect here to make it look like a bone. Um, and then there is also a magnet in the bone as well. To get it to magnetise to Mio Pup when he's eating it. Um, so yeah, that's the bone. Um, and before we move on to the puppy itself, or the robotic puppy itself. Um, we are going to be using the Texter Scooby-Doo ball to test him out. Um, so yeah, now... Here is Mio. Um, there we go. Zoom out so you have a better look at him. Um, but yeah, let's move him a bit further to the camera here. But here he is. This is the um, Mio pup in all of his adorably awesome glory. Um, now this, I'll just take the camera off the stand here just so you can get a better look that is Mio's mouth um put this aside but this is Mio's mouth um and it also although I don't know if you can see it that's his nose there we are there are two if I just do this a minute there are two holes one there, or two circles one there and one there um and those are what allow the bone to magnetise to him when he is eating his food. Um, so that's his mouth. And um, here is his head. Now, if you look very closely, you can see these little... Um, I'll try and get it here. Um... But you can pause the video if you want to, guys, to see this. But there are some little dashes here on his head. Because this is a head sensor here, essentially. This is a head sensor um, for you to be able to pet or stroke Mio. Um, and when you do stroke Mio, these dashes are highlighted and light up red which you guys will see very shortly. Um, these are his ears now that he did not come like this, don't worry. Um, as you guys can probably see, it's because the actual silicone or rubber material has come off over time. Um, because um, one of my family members, friends, gave me this and he'd had it this friend had had it for a long time beforehand um so yeah that's his ears and then you also have i believe this is another kind of sensor stroke sensor on the back of his head for you to be able to stroke him i'm not too sure or maybe that's just his design in general and then you've got what looks like a collar around his neck that's part of his design um hello and then this is his nose which 
Oh, is also a power button, as you guys can see, but we'll turn him off just for the moment. Okay, Mia, let's just turn you off for a moment. There we go. Um, because we're going to show that in a minute. Um, and then here is his eyes. Now, this little black screen displays his eyes, which also display his emotions with the display on his eyes. Um, and he's very smooth, actually. He's a really smooth robotic pet. Um, and here is also a another stroke sensor um so he can feel the motion of your hand stroking his back which to me is like it calm him down if he's excited and here's his little um his little tail again the material has worn off over over time um so yeah and then here is the now I'm not too sure what this pattern is. I believe that's the logo, but yeah, that's his little logo. But that lights up, and that lights up when you turn him on. Um, yeah, and then you've got if we turn him, <coughs> if we turn him upside down, you'll find a humongous sticker. Um, which if you look closely. Is also shaped like Mi Mio's logo, um, and that's where the sound is produced. And then you also have the—you can't see that very well—but you also have the Tiger Electronics logo. Um, and then his button here. Now, um, this button is his reset button. So if you want to reset Mio, put um if you did want to although i'm not sure you would um but that resets me out and then this is two modes so one is try me um which i can show you so this is try me mode um yeah so th that just shows you a bit of an idea on how he works. Sorry for doing that, Mio Pup. And then, oops, and then this is his play mode where you, basically his normal mode where you play with him and interact with him in many ways. Um. So, yeah, and then there's his little feet. And, oh dear, I'm pounding him on the ground. Sorry, Mio. Um... As a reminder, no, me, I put so hard in this video. Um, but these, his hind feet are where you put in his battery. So these two are the battery compartments, but I would show you what the inside looks like. But they are tightly screwed. But you need, what happens is you need two AA alkaline batteries like... Energizer, Duracell, Panasonic, etc. As long as they're not rechargeable batteries, he will work. But when you unscrew his feet, you put one battery in right side up, the other battery in upside down, and it's the same both sides, otherwise he won't work properly. Um, but, yeah. And then, also that's his information, but I'm not sure you can read that. Um, but you don't need to know that this. And then there's another sensor here under Mio's chin um, that allows you to tickle him uh, or stroke his chin. Um, so now let's do a little bit of a demo on how Mio Pup works. Um, so you push his nose here. Now you must be very careful as well. My Mio Pup's nose does get stuck. Oops, but if you turn him on, um, he's, he's pulling puppy eyes at me. If you, um, no, don't be sad on camera, Mio. Not on camera. Right, so if you strike him under his chin, 
um, or tickle him. He likes it a lot, and you can see his um, first stroke. Let's see. Do this again. See if we can get his ears to move. Come on, Mio. Come on. Let's know. Wag your ears for the camera. Okay, but if you... There we go. His ears and his tail wag. Um, right, but what we're going to do is we're going to make him happy because he's a bit sad. Um, I reset him. I reset him just for this video to show you from scratch. So, your me Oprah here... He'll display his feelings through his eyes, and as you can see, he is sad at the moment. Um, but and then that means he's happy. Um, but if he can display his other eyes, there we go. Um, yes, and you can you can also talk to him. You can talk to Neo. So, um, if I say hi Mio he's happy so okay hi Mio can you say hi he says hi he says hi to the camera view camera viewers we love you Mio pop and also he loves it when you tell him that he that you love him um so when you get your Mio pop um You'll find he behaves like this, so you do need to give him love and attention to make him happy. And also, he is in autonomous mode pretty much the whole time, um, where he'll just do his own thing. Mia! Come here! Come here, Mio. Come here. Okay, now let's show you how the bone works. Hopefully, you can get him to walk. Um, okay, but first of all, if I put my hand on his back or stroke it, he is happy. Um, and also, I'm gonna have to put the camera down to show you this. Um, but if you, um, oh yeah, and his mouth lights up too. But if, okay, well, I will dip, just ditch the stand now. But if you stroke his head and his chin at the same time, I'm going to try and see if this works. Um, okay. Let's just do it. Let's yeah. Let's do it like this. But if we turn him this way, but if you stroke his head and his chin at the same time, he will sing and dance. Um, and his eyes display this pattern, and his head lights up, and then you can see his mouth. Lights up. This looks great in the dark, also. Um, but yeah, the eye pop sings. Now he does about. I believe it's. There we go. He's walking on camera. That's great. Um, I think he does about four, three or to four different songs, displaying his emotions. He can hear me now, can't you, Mio? Um, he will do different songs. Um. <clears throat> And what we're going to do now is we're going to feed him. So for that, you place the bone, yes, you're getting food now, in his mouth. You'll eat it, and if you, if you take it out of his mouth at the wrong time, he will whimper and cry. So we're going to leave it in his mouth. And then he displays different facial expressions, showing that he has enjoyed his bone and he's now walking for the camera that's brilliant
it's brilliant for what I'm about to show you. Um, he can kick this ball. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this ball here. Mia, ball, what to play? Want to play ball? Yeah? Let's play ball, Mia. There we go. So hopefully, if we let tickle his chin, um, he will walk. I'll tell you a way we can do this. Oh, there we go. And then he can kick it. Um, and also, there is a way to stop him from walking if you want to. Um, if we put our hand on his back for a few seconds and then... Pet his head. Um, okay, so he's going to kick this ball at us now. Um, but if we, sorry about that, guys. If we put our hand on his back and stroke his head at the same time. He displays a little heart pattern. Um, and if you stroke him enough, you get this display. Um, okay, yeah, let's just move you over here a bit, yeah? Okay. Um, so, he gives you the love heart eyes when he is incredibly happy and he looks back to giving him affection. So, we just let him do his own thing. His eyes are going to look panicked in a minute. Um, because he doesn't like to be left alone. Oh yeah, um, if you do leave him alone, then he will get sad and will pull puppy eyes and cry and whine and be sad. So it's best not to leave him on his own. And also, another thing he'll do is he will fall asleep now i can't necessarily show you that in this video because it may take it will take too long but hopefully he'll walk um because i'm going to show you a way you can stop him from walking just let him um look at those eyes um this is what he does when he is waiting now, if you press his nose, like that, I had to do it quickly because I was running out of time. Then he will show dizzy, like he is dizzy. Um, and also, there you go. And if you keep pressing his nose, um, stroke his head, it will be okay. But if you press his nose, He doesn't, he doesn't like it. Um, so what we're going to do is, again, we're going to put the camera down. I'm sorry, sweetheart. I'm sorry, Mia. Okay, what we're going to do now is we're going to make him happy again. Now I'm... Um, there we go, and then we have his eyes, now he is talking to me, hi Mia, you enjoying yourself, you happy, happy Mia pup, yeah, that's good, also, mm. And then he's just walking, doing his own thing. We love him. I love him, yeah. He's a very clever puppy. Um, and when he's walking, he struts because he's like a famous cat walking puppy that loves affection and people. Um, so, 
We'll just see if we can get him to kick the ball one more time. Um, I will get him to do this other song now, so bear with me a moment. There we go. This is his other song. And it's very satisfying to watch. I like watching his face. Um, but, yeah, he has another song that he does. One song he does is when he is when he feels unwell, which is, by the way, when you haven't fed him. Um, and haven't been giving him attention, it makes him sick or makes him upset. Um, but, yeah. So, please be sure to not leave him out. Now, I'm not entirely sure of the price of this Mio Pup. Because I'm not sure they sell them anymore. The only way I believe you can get Mio Pup is on eBay. Um, and the price ranges are quite different. Um, but if you haven't got a Mio Pup, try and... Um, try to get him... There we go. It displays... Oops, displays there. And then if you look closely at this logo, it is... There we go, we got him to kick it. Now for a small puppy, that is a lot of strength. Um, you're welcome, Neo. You're welcome. Um, so, let's just... No, we'll keep it switched on. Um... <clears throat> So thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video on my Mio Pup review. Um, if you did enjoy it, please be sure to like, subscribe and leave a comment below telling me what you think. Because I will um, accept your feedback. And I am... Let's just turn him off for a moment. I am still taking video requests and shout out so please drop a comment down below so you don't miss out and also be sure to turn notifications on or post notifications on um to make sure you never miss out on any of my videos and are kept up to date on my videos and when i post them um so yeah thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you again soon um so mia Mio? Mio? Okay, he's a bit... I think he's getting a bit tired now. I'll get Mio up to say goodbye. Um, he's just strutting off. Mio? Mio pup? Can you say goodbye? Say goodbye to the viewers. Say bye-bye, YouTube. Um, he says bye-bye. Um, so, so yeah, thank you guys for watching.